Hi again. In this little set of videos, I'm looking at the way we use Google Sites to collect and collate information ready to be put up onto the web. And in this particular case, I'm looking at pages. Now, if you've got one single page, which is where you start off with, then just adding stuff to the list is just huge. You get one great long page, which is difficult to navigate. An easy way to do it is to set up separate pages like I have here. And you'll see down here, if I click into the Pages tab on the menu, I've got my portfolio page, my blog page, a contacts page, and a slide set. Now, you can move these around quite easily, picking up and moving them. You can add them, so you can add a new one. And I've got nothing on that one particularly at the moment. And let's put this one down as when, when it's finished doing it. And I'll just click onto the right there. And let's look, rename the page. Let's rename it Collection. Because what I'm going to do is, and I'll just click out of that so it creates it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick this one up here and just hold it over the top of that one, Collection. And I'm just going to let it go. And it should put it back within it. Now, it's not doing it for some reason. Let's just try this one. No, it doesn't want to know. Oh, it is. Yep, there it is. I've actually made it. So you hold it and put it over the top of the one before. Now, when you look at it, you'll see slide set or collection added to the blog. And you can see there's a little arrow here saying if I do that when I publish, well, let's have a just look at this, just preview it. Because now when I've previewed it, you can see it's been added to a drop land down list under the blog. So clicking on the little star over there to get rid of that and go back to editing page, just pick it up and drop it onto the top of the one you had before or whichever one you want to put it under. So Pages allows you to organise your content without it being one great long streaming page. Here you can put them into separate pages and people can see and find the subjects very easily. And Google Sites automatically adds the menu up to the top right hand side so it's easy to use. Okay.